hello welcome to my channel original lady eve elements to raw llc welcome subscribers non-subscribers cross watchers subscribe to my channel all newcomers who are watching this if this resonates with you i'm glad that it does it means that spirit got their message across all right now everybody has free will so take it how it applies if you'd like to book a personal reading with me, all that information is found down in the description box below. I do email readings. I do numerology reports, which are, are um, $55. Okay, I need your birth chart and the time that you were born. If you adopted, don't know your time, that's okay. I'll figure out how to work around that. Um, what else? Thumbs up this video and all my other videos if you're watching them. Okay, hit that like button, that bell notification to be notified of upcoming content on my channel i will no longer um, be time stamping my videos as well as uploading defensive magic techniques all my defensive magic techniques will be included in my readings but it's a separate price to be taught or for me to tell you how to um maneuver your ritual for your specific reading everybody's different especially regarding money love or other okay definitely so i also have a group on facebook that's 50 dollars per year to learn how to master voodoo uh a friend i was taught that was from barbados she used to tell me honey voodoo uh voodoo is prayer it's a religion but hoodoo is like instant mashed potatoes teaching hoodoo magic 101 classes in session if i when I do receive enough students in the class. I will begin that session. But for now, for those that want to join, DM me Eve Elements on Facebook. Okay? Let me know that you are interested in, in joining the class, Teaching Hoodoo Magic 101 class is in session. Teaching Hoodoo Magic 101 class is in session. All right? If you'd like to book a personal reading on Facebook, it's facebook.com slash fire spell. Facebook.com slash fire spell. If you would like to purchase my hex deck, DM me in regards to my hex deck. And I can get that deck out to you. Capricorn, what's going on in your love realm? I think I got all the information out. <laughs> Two minutes in. Okay. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Lilith, Capricorn. What's going on in your love realm? This is June. Ooh, today is um, first day of summer. I think it's June 21st. Wow. I'm a spring baby, so... Okay, so let's get it. Let's get into this. Support this channel. Support my Facebook page. I do not accept friend requests at this time on my Facebook page, but you can feel free to send me a message. You can follow me on Instagram, Eve Elements LLC. I'm still working on that. I got two, two um, channels on Instagram. You can follow my regular one, or you can Eve Elements. You can follow Eve Elements LLC. I think they're both the same Eve Elements LLC. I have two, two with the same name, probably. Who knows? Let me check. <laughs> Ooh, you know I got to keep up. Okay, give me a second. I think it is the same. Yeah, it is Eve Elements LLC. You'll see a picture of me with red hair, and then the other one is with tarot card. Eve Elements LLC. Capricorn, let's get into your reading. Yes, you are. What messages do you have for Capricorn in a love realm? Everybody knows that when I do my readings, whatever cards that come out, that's the message that Yeshua needs you to hear. E-O-I-A, E-O-I-A, E-O-I-A. Only Archangels of the Heavenly Court, Archangel Michael, 
prophet Ael, Samael, are invited into this circle. While I'm doing these tarot card readings, Yeshua is allowed in this circle. While I'm doing this reading, Spirit of the Most High God, Maldachek is invited into this circle. Any low vibrational energy or entities are not allowed in this circle. You're not allowed in this circle whatsoever. You're not welcome. You will get kicked the F out <laughs> by this Archangel. Okay, I'm not playing. I need to deliver these messages just like Archangel Samuel, the messenger. Be sending messages when Yeshua needs something to be said to the world. Okay, now, again, I will be doing my celebrity readings. Pick it back up. I'm just trying to figure out which celebrity I want to read. I go by energy. I just don't read everybody. Okay? Whichever celebrity I feel needs my need, needs the messages and I'm sure to get these messages that needs to go out. That's the one that needs my help the most. I'm here in Kodak Black for some reason. So maybe I'll do a reading on Kodak, a personal reading on Kodak Black up here. See what's going on Kodak Black. And I heard Fetty Wap. So those two I'll be reading soon within the week. I just have to get ready for my daughter's graduation. So I'm going to be very busy this week. Got hair and nails to do, honey. Got to look, look, look our best for graduation. Shoot, graduating student and the mama to the graduating student. My baby's in JROTC military. What are you talking about? What up? What up? Okay. I'm a proud mama of a JROTC student. What up? Oh, and for all those out there taking care of their kids, whether you male or female, happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. God bless y'all all doing the damn thing. Many blessings to y'all around the world. Around the world. Happy Father's Day. Any messages for Capricorn, real quick? Yeah, sure. Do you have any messages for Capricorn? Any messages for Capricorn? And then I'll start back up with the water signs later on. My daughter be hounding me. I want to watch some cartoons. <laughs> okay. It could be a separation on the horizon for some of you that are in relationships, Capricorn. Let me get some more information first before I tell you what I see, okay? Okay, wow. This is so you, Capricorn. Capricorn is the most sensitive out of the uh, earth signs. You would think it'd be Taurus, but it's not. Taurus is semi-sensitive. Virgos is just stone, like stoic, and Capricorn is stoic yet sensitive. It's like an Eminem. No, not an Eminem. Wrong. They're like hard on the outside, soft on the inside, like jelly bean. That's a Capricorn. Anything for love, Capricorn. Someone rising Venus, no snow. Lilith. That's your any messages. Capricorn. Any messages regarding Capricorn? What's going on for the month of June? Even though you didn't time stamp, but I'm just saying it's for my own benefit because I'll forget what video I put the fuck up in. Okay, um, any messages for Capricorn, please? Any messages for Capricorn, please? Uh, I have a quick message because Spirit just flashed something. Okay. This is not for all of y'all, so don't take offense to those. This is not for you, this message I'm about to dish out. But for the individual, and you know who you are because I see you behind the scenes, that keep putting thumbs down on all my videos, you, I'm not even, you crazy ass motherfucking nut. Stop hating because I know who you are, okay? That person with the red hair. Mm-hmm. That's all I'm going to say. Stop hating. Stop. I see red hair. I see blonde hair. Okay. You should probably dye your hair. Keep it up. Keep messing with me. Your hair going to fall the fuck out. I ain't the one. Yes, I am protected by Yeshua. You need to go get your life and go get mental health. 
while you add it. Mental health ain't no joke, and I don't play with that one, okay? But stop coming on my channel hating. If it don't resonate, it don't resonate. But don't be just sitting up there just putting thumbs down because you gang stalking me from Instagram and Facebook and then here. You know who you are. Don't be mad if I took your man, bitch. <laughs> I said it. My wife is better than yours, dry ass coochie bitch. I said it. Ain't it's not my problem that you you with my ex and my ex is back here because you ain't got no wop. You have the Sahara Desert between your legs. Oops, I said it. Busted bitch. Okay. Great love is worth taking for Capricorn. The steps you're guided to take. Okay, great love is worth taking. The steps you're guided to take. It seems to me you may or may not want to work on this relationship that you have. But let's get the full scope of the story, Capricorn. Let's get into it. Sorry I had to put that on your reading, Capricorn. This ain't for you, boo. You know I love my Cappies. We got downcast pride number 20. Break it down into two that deals with relationships, partnerships, situationships. We have separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. So you're not separated yet from this individual. Getting to know each other. You already know each other. But you don't I don't think you want to renew this situation. But you're hiding your true self. You're hiding what you really want to say to this individual. And by doing that, you're sacrificing yourself. Don't do that to yourself, Capricorn. Let go of control issues. Because it seems to me like by you holding back and not saying how you truly feel, Capricorn, it's like a sacrifice. It's like a self-sacrifice. Right? I just heard spirits say self-serving. All right? Don't do that to yourself, Capricorn. Don't do it. All right? Look, flirt in the reverse. Very soon. It's like you're cutting yourself off. From this individual healing family issues yeah this is dealing with the family dynamic let go of control issues and healing family issues in reverse so y'all been together for a while all right you feel like it's not working out you want to separate from this individual you're not taking the time out to reintroduce yourself to this relationship capricorn or this could be a person doing this you're hiding your true self. You're hiding your anger. Something's making you angry. Look at all that red. You're hiding your emotions. You're, you're masking them. You're masking your emotions. And by you doing that, you're sacrificing yourself. You need to stop trying to control the situation. If you don't like something, you need to let it be known, Capcom. Open your mouth. Especially in love. You need to be expressive. You need to have that expression, Capricorn. You need to let it out. Anger, lust, love, rage, harmony, whatever it is, you need to let it out. Stop hiding your true self. Putting yourself up for self-sacrifice. You need to stop trying to control that. You're not even flirting. Right now, it's like there's no chemi chemistry. Something... Whatever the situation is with your person, Capricorn, or vice versa, okay? Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. This could stem from your childhood, okay? You have a hard time forgiving issues that go on with you in the realms of love, Capricorn. That's the issue you have, and it stems from your childhood with your mother. You could have seen when your mom and your father, and your, your mom and your dad were argument arguing over one of the other parents cheating on the other one, or some or something to that situation. But whatever it is, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. You need to, even if they're deceased, okay, have a talk with the spirit of your parents that have passed on. You know, light a white candle, the whole shebang. And you know, go and knees pray, go visit their grave sites, and you know, resolve this issue from the 3D to the 5D. Resolve this issue, okay? Stop trying to control the, the outcome of the situation. We got flirt reverse very soon, and again, like I said, healing family issues, okay? So, we have 
What is this one? Downcast pride. Yeah. Stop being so prideful, Capricorn. All right? Because there is a separation coming at very soon. It's on the horizon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. So if you want that separation now, Capricorn, don't hide it. Talk about it. Look, I'm not feeling this situation. We've been together 10 years, 5 years, 7 years, 3 years, a year. Maybe 6 months for some of you. And I'm not feeling the connection is not there. So you need to make the effort to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Let this person know you'd like to separate from them. Okay? It's not working out. If it ain't working out, Capricorn, it ain't working out. Or this could be this person afraid to let you know. But in either case... You know, love is out there for you. If this is not the one, someone else is out there for you. All right? The angels are even separating you from this person. Or separating them from you. This is not your person. I don't even see soulmate up here. Okay? It could have been a karmic connection that you were in. Where someone had control issues. If this is not you, this was your person. Too controlling, too demanding. You could be dealing with a fire sign with all this red up in here. What's going on in the realms of love with Capricorn? Please show me, Yeshua. God of the Most High God. We had 16 minutes. Okay, so. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. For the person's gang stalking me, one or other or more. Well, I know who you are, but I'm saying it like that just to benefit the channel. But you know who you are. Stop gang stalking me. Go get your life. I'm sure you got other things better to do than watch me. I keep hearing that Mariah Carey song. Why are you so obsessed with me? <laughs> It's clear that you're upset with me. <laughs> My God. <laughs> I find everything funny, yo. People that do that shit. <laughs> y'all think y'all being petty, but you're really being stupid. Yo, even spirit is looking at you saying you're stupid. you like, I'm be petty. I'm a, I'm a thumbs down all the videos. And I'm other. You're not really hurting me. It's still my channel. My channel not going nowhere. I don't give a fuck if it's just me on here and no subscribers. I'm still going to do me. I'm still going to get Spirit's message out there to the masses. You're not stopping me because the devil is a liar. <laughs> and you're not upsetting me. Thank you for being my biggest fan. And thank you for all that energy you're putting into me because it gives me power. So, thank you. Now, Capricorn, express your love. Express yourself. Express whatever it is you feel in this relationship to the person that you most are angry with. If they did something that hurt your feelings, that's why you want to separate from this individual. Let it be known. Sit down. Don't hide yourself. Hiding your true self, don't ever do that. Don't ever mask your feelings for nobody. Don't dim your light, Capricorn. It's not worth it. You're better than that, okay? Try practicing also, Capricorn, self-love and self-care. All right? You are a beautiful creature, Capricorn. You are very beautiful. Let your light shine, Capricorn. You are Mother Gaia. You are an earth sign. Without you, there would be no life, honey. Things grow when you are happy. You ever notice that, Capricorn? I have a Capricorn child that wherever we move to, if we in a place, even if we in a park, grass start to grow. Abundance. That's what you bring in. Now we have the aid of clubs here. There's a lot of communication. See, there's that communication. You could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Some of you, you, hold on, give me a second. Whew, thank you. 
We have the Six of Swords here, moving to calmer waters with the Queen of Wands here. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, so it, it, it looks like a third party situation is going on and you want to remove yourself from the equation. And that's what you're going to be talking about. Or your person could be saying they met someone. Because the Queen of, the King of Swords is facing the Queen of Hearts. So these people know each other. But this Queen of Hearts does not know this fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But this King of Swords does. The, whoever this male energy is, this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. He is talking to two females here. You and another person, uh, Capricorn. And this is why you're emotional. You're showing up as the Queen of Cups. Your person will end it with this fire sign. That's what I'm looking at, Capricorn. The air sign will leave this fire sign and remain with you. But this only occurs as long as you have this discussion that you want to separate from them. Once they realize that you're trying to leave them, they're going to separate themselves from this fire sign. So take control of the situation, Capricorn. That is only for those that want their situation back. If you want your husband or your partner back or the person that you're going out with back, you let them clearly know. Don't hide yourself. The more you hide yourself, the more they be with this fire sign person. Look, three of swords, separation, breakup, heartbreak. Unknown love. The unknown love is this queen of cup. Uh, queen of. She got fire and water in her chart. She's the unknown lover. So yes, this is dealing with a third party situation here. Okay, yeah. This air sign will leave this one in nine days. All you have to do is talk. Open your mouth, Capricorn. Open your mouth. One more card so I close this reading out. Thank you, Spirit. I appreciate it. Not Spirit. Yeshua. He has a name. <laughs> one more. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. There's one more. Five of Swords. Yes. Once you express yourself, it's going to kick off and start creating conflict between your person and the person that they're seeing on the side. Five of Swords. Your person going to be up in their head about this. Conflicted. Then there's separation. Right, I see them wanting to work on this with you. They're a little, they're gonna be a little frustrated with you telling them that you want to separate from them. And this person's trying to have their cake and eat it too. But you need to put your foot down, stop being all shy and shit. Tell them how Ti is Capricorn. With that being said, be blessed.